Imagine a creature that feeds on bones but has no mouth. Sounds like a nightmare, but it's reality. In the depths of the ocean, where sunlight never penetrates, there are worms that feed on bones, species so strange that they defy logic. These worms, known as Ostex, were first discovered in 2002 on a whale carcass at a depth of 2,800 meters. They have no mouth or stomach. Instead, they burrow into bones using root-like tissues that dissolve bone material with the help of symbiotic bacteria. What's even more interesting, many species of these worms are bioluminescent, an adaptation that is still not fully understood. Some scientists believe it helps them attract mates in the perpetual darkness. Others believe it is a form of communication or camouflage. But here's a rare fact. Despite decades of research, new species of these bone-eating worms are still being discovered, each with unique glowing forms and behaviors that we are only beginning to document. A rare fact. At 7,200 meters in the Mariana Trench, Explorers recorded an anglerfish whose bioluminescent organs are arranged like the facets of a cut gem, each emitting a different hue and controlled by independent neural clusters. This suggests not only camouflage, but perhaps communication or mate attraction previously thought impossible at those depths. Every glimmer of light in these depths is precious, the promise of food or a warning of danger. The anglerfish's lure, the Elysium, evolved from its dorsal fin, glowing thanks to symbiotic bacteria. These bacteria are unique. They emit such pure light that, when activated, it can outshine the fluttering plankton for several meters around. During a recent expedition using an ROV to a depth of 5,800 meters, scientists recorded how the devilfish adjusts the frequency of its light within milliseconds an ability previously unknown in vertebrates. But beyond the familiar genera Melanostis and Linifrine, traces of undescribed species are emerging. Specimens collected in near-freezing basins revealed tiny devilfish-like forms with lures that pulsed green and blue in alternating rhythms, as if transmitting signals in a secret language. Not a single specimen has ever been recovered alive. All we have are fleeting video footage and a few damaged specimens, whose DNA indicates their lineage split millions of years ago. Reproduction in the abyss is a gamble. Males, dwarfed and blind, must find a female by scent. Upon contact, some species fuse their bodies to hers, becoming nothing more than a pair of gonads, a living parasite, yet a lifeline for perpetuating the species. It is one of nature's most extreme partnerships, life birthed from sacrifice. In the quiet, crushing depths of our oceans, life finds a way not only to survive, but to evolve into forms that we can barely comprehend. It reminds us that even in the most desolate places, existence continues, mysterious, stable, and full of surprises. What other secrets lie hidden in the darkness, just waiting to challenge our understanding of life itself? As we conclude this journey into darkness, remember, Every unanswered question about these fish reflects the mysteries that still lurk in our own world and within ourselves. If you're intrigued by this journey into the unknown, please consider supporting our channel. We are a young channel, hungry like these bone-eating worms, eager to tell you more unknown stories from the depths of our planet. Every subscription, like, or repost helps us grow and continue to explore the frontiers of science and nature.